woman that I was mentoring, I've been knowing her her whole life, uh, got pregnant, uh, gave birth to a little boy, and left him at the hospital with my name. I'm t- I, they don't Wait. put a, put him in a basket and put him on your doorstep. They just tag a little post it to him now at the hospital with yeah. your name. Yeah. yeah. No. Wow. Yes. I did. My body's all tingling. It is, should be so... tingling. It's definitely a gift from God. This was definitely right. way bigger Ugh. than me. This was something that was supposed to happen. And uh, the hospital called, and they're like, um, yeah, your baby's ready? I swear <laughs> to God. That did like, not happen. No. Your baby is ready. Like, oh, I had ordered God. the baby. And I thought it was one of my comic friends. And I was like, ha, ha, the fries come with that baby. <laughs> <laughs> and I hung up the phone. Oh, my God. I was like, I ain't nobody time for y'all. Bye, boom. Bye, Felicia. No, yeah. <laughs> they are. Uh, they call back and the That's lady nurse, was like, no. Nurse Felicia to you. Nurse yeah, that Felicia. was Nurse Felicia. Yes. And uh, they're like, no, this is, you know, no joke. You know, we really have a baby, uh, you know, such and such. Um, she gave birth to a baby boy um, and he's uh, three days old and um, we need to place him. Place what? Um, what does that mean? They're like, you can either, you know, she got an attitude. You can either take the baby or we're going to put him in the system. Oh, I was God. like, what is that? That sounds like the Matrix. I don't right. know what that is. <laughs> uh, it sounded dark. And right. uh, literally my parents were there visiting and I talked to them. And my mother, she always was very straightforward. She looked at me and she was like, you're 90 years old. Uh, you ain't got no eggs left. You need to go on and get that baby. I'm telling you. She your mother like, said what? that. What? She said yeah. you don't have any No, eggs. she literally was yeah. like. You're 90 years old. You have no man. You have no kids. You got one egg left, and it is fried. <laughs> she literally was like, go get that baby. Get so a life. How long did you think wow. about it? How long? The, oh, the woman only gave us like, I said, can I have 20 minutes? Can I have an hour? She was No, that's what it was. I was like, can I have a couple hours and I'll call you back? Uh, no, you can have 20 minutes. <gasps> wow. To make a lifelong decision. And it was like, I had chills. I got nauseous. I was like, I don't know what to do. And my mom and dad literally were like, why not? So then I called her back and I was like, okay, I'm just going to ask you a serious question. What is the return policy? <laughs> <laughs> you weren't kidding. I literally, I was serious. Like, I said, you have to understand, ma'am, what if I, I, I'm bad? What if I don't know what I'm doing? What if this is not good? <sighs> the lady was like, ah. she was like, look. Okay, if you can't, can't do it and you just can't take the baby, then I guess we'd have to take him back and put him in the system. Oh, my god! That's gosh. how she spoke to me. And I, I just needed to know, you know. Mm-hmm. I said, okay, 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 okay. I said, okay, 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 I'll take him. Just bring him. And I hung up the phone. And they told us that you have literally, it was like an hour. The social worker is bringing the baby. You have to have a car seat or they won't leave him. You have to have a car seat and a bassinet. First of all, they Do you have 20 minutes and you got stuff by Target? That's exactly what we did. My exactly. mom and dad owned. My dad looking for the old bassinet, the, right. the white one. Right. It's all weaved. They don't even make those. He's like, I don't see a bassinet. I don't see a bassinet. I was like, Daddy, they don't make the bassinets. Now they're play pins. Yeah. Oh, the play yards. Yeah. Yeah. He's all this thing right here. This ain't a bassinet. Right. Oh my. So we grabbed that and we had the car seat. And by the time we got home, they come in with the baby. This is serious. With a plastic bag, a clear like a trash bag of diapers and little formula bottles and something for his uh, when they cut off the umbilical cord Uh some ointments I'm telling you it's like this and a sheet of paper and she says okay you gotta feed the baby uh, every two hours only give him two ounces of milk Um, here's some stuff for the thing and some diapers good luck